can't be in Africa. But you just can't say, well, we send all y'all back to Africa. You can't. Because we the original American as well. The original American. What up with it, man? It's your boy, Timmy the Guy. You already know what it is. Hey, look. I wanted to wrap up some real quick. Umar Johnson. You know what I'm saying? And give my two cents on this latest little viral moment. You know what I mean? Where he was debating uh, Joe Budden on his podcast about... I don't, I don't know if Joe Budden said it or whatever. I'm pretty sure he would say something like this. But I think he was talking about how Eminem was the greatest this and that, you know, rapper or whatever. You know what I mean? And Umar Johnson was coming out talking about that can't happen. You know what I'm saying? Because Africans are the greatest in all things. You know what I'm saying? Basically, to cut everything short. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I'm going to put this out on TikTok first. And then I'm going to spread it from there. You know what I'm saying? So, I ain't going to go this too long. You know, it's simple, straight to the point. You know what I'm saying? Episode, stop playing, number one. You know what I'm saying? Stop playing. But, you know, shout out to Dan Calloway, too, because he's been trying to, you know, have a little debate thing with Dr. Umar, but he ain't been trying to let that happen or whatever. This has been some back and forth bickering. Everybody know him, too. Everybody know Dan Calloway. But, you know, at the same time, I agree on, on the agreement side. I agree with, um... You know, him talking about how Eminem could never be the greatest, you know what I'm saying? Um, because, you know, the African thing he throw in there. But besides that point, you know, he can never be the greatest because there are far more greater. Like, boy, stop playing. Stop playing with Twister. Stop playing with Twister. Twister is the greatest fast rapper. You know what I'm saying? The greatest to spit like, you know what I'm saying? That you know what I mean? I forgot what it's originally called, you know. I, it's on the tip of my tongue, but I don't want to ride it that long because it's sitting, sitting up here clean. But don't play on that point. And then on the other point, Lil Wayne is the greatest to do it. Then we could ride that in because I know how to ride. That's just in my opinion on the Lil Wayne thing. To me, no, Wayne, excuse me, Wayne is the greatest to do it, you know what I mean? But when we talk about the greats in hip-hop rap, we talking about Wayne, Big, even though Big is uh, Jamaican, but that's still that's still American or whatever, you know, however you want to put it. You know, a lot of people, that might go over a lot of folks heads, you know what I'm saying? But that's American, you know what I'm saying? Pop. Even, you know, we can go down to the Kendrick Lamar's. We can go down to, like, the NBA Young Boys. You know, we can, we can go up and down. We can even talk about somebody who, not even on the top of nobody's mind, who are great. We could talk about what Soldier Boy did. You know what I'm saying? We could talk about what Too Short used to do out, of the, out the trunk of his car. We could talk about what Nelly did. St. Lolo, but well, now we can talk about what Nelly did in the records he sold. You know what I'm saying? We could talk about the Cash Money era. We could talk about the um, No Limit era. We could talk about that. Like, don't don't play with it like that. You know what I'm saying? Don't play with it like that. You know, to say he is even in the category of the greats. Stop playing. Stop. Nas. Jay-Z? You know what I'm saying? Like, Jada Kiss? And then you go put some Emmett. Nah, bro, I don't want to hear that. I want to hear about some Jay-Z, some Nas, Tupac, Biggie. You know what I'm saying? I want to hear about what, what Nelly did. He had his run, but you know what I'm saying? What Nelly did when he bust through the door. You know what I mean? St. Lunatics, you know what I mean? Like, we can even switch it over and go into Sexy Ruth. What she doing, I'll go up to Lil' Kim and, you know what I'm saying, Trina, Trick Daddy. Like, boy, stop playing with it like that. You know what I'm saying? Don't, don't even put it, 
don't don't you can't you can't you can't do it. And then we could we feel go into the second half. You're not an indigenous American. You can't never be the great. You're not the great. We the greatest in everything, all things. This the goofy side of Umar. Like for for first. Shout out to JT the bigger figure too, because I'm finna say this right off the flip. Right off the flap. You know what I'm saying? I get myself my own roses. But boy, you ain't did nothing like JT even did. I think he was out there in Africa for like three years. And he but he films all these things and the things he done did. Even um Um I think it's Mr. Beast, the white boy, Mr. Beast. How he he went out there, he did some things. Dr. Umo ain't did nothing for Africa. You sit in America and talk African this, African that. And shout out to my brothers and sisters from Africa that I know and I talk to and I seen. And they keep it real, bro. Don't try to get these things in your head to where they not keeping it real. No, a lot of them do keep it real, bro. And they let you know. They already know where you're from. You know what I'm saying? Like, they always call me Rasta, man. Or, you know, but they come straight out like, we know. We know you American. Why, we, who made you come out here or whatever? You know what I'm saying? We had plenty of talks. I don't got on film. But I got a lot of footage on me out there. You know what I'm saying? Had a good time. Went through my own things or whatever. I talk about it and I keep it real long. You know what I mean? But, like, like, got through more on this situation. I just want to touch on the rap, hip-hop thing. And I'm not finished, but I want to touch on that. But overall, bro, you ain't, like, the money you getting from, like, bro, the agent work you're doing is worth nothing, bro. It's worth nothing. And it's already over. And everybody already see what's going on. America is the holy land. Everybody know this. Everybody know who we are. Everybody know who we are. And then at the same time, Africa is the youngest continent. You can Google that shit. Africa is the youngest continent. It's a baby. We was growing and we still we still help them. But at the end of this, because I want to end it, you know what I'm saying? Who is a great rapper from Africa? In the nineties, I can hear them. I can hear a mother try to come off the tip. Oh, Tupac or something like that. Boy, he not African. Search his name too, and learn who a more um to uh a Tupac Amori. Learn about him from South America. Learn about him and why his mama named to that. You know what I'm saying? And he even talked about that. He talked about that. Amaru, you know what I'm saying? Amaru Shakur, if, if, I ain't, if I ain't mistaken. Research that. But much peace and love, don't try to because we all over. You can't label somebody to one area. That's how you can come in and have folks saying they from this area. You ain't even from her. Or y'all just African. No, nah, we all over. We all over. But much peace and love, big salute. This is a great day to be alive. Great day to be alive.